In this tutorial, we are going to show you how to import custom wearables and custom avatars into MetaTailor. Let's go to sketchfab.com and find a cool asset. Here is an awesome free cyberpunk jacket made by the artist Dejan31. Go ahead and download the asset OBJ file. Let's jump over to MetaTailor and select an avatar. First, click Import and select Cloth, Accessory. Next, import the OBJ file. The item will immediately appear in the viewport. You can add textures during import, but we're going to skip ahead and add them later. Clicking different categories will snap the item to a relevant region of the avatar's body. Select Jacket as the item category and click Next. Now you are in the pose matching stage. Use the gizmo tools to line up the item and then click Start Pose Match. It does exactly what you think. Let's line up the elbows and wrists to match the pose of the jacket. When you're done, click Confirm, then click Next. Congratulations. You've just pose matched, fitted, rigged, and converted this jacket into a fully interoperable 3D wearable. Now let's add those textures. The item is now fully interoperable, which means it never has to be imported or fitted again. The jacket will automatically retarget itself to fit any custom avatar in your library. You can also use this item to build outfits, since it will procedurally layer itself with any combination of other items in your library. In this next example, let's import an item directly from Marvelous Designer. First, save and export the item as an OBJ or FBX. Open MetaTailor, click Import, Cloth Accessories. Add the textures and complete the pose matching process. Great, your item is now part of your interoperable asset library. MetaTailor allows you to import custom avatars and avatars from popular platforms. To start, let's jump over to Mixamo.com and download Romero the Zombie. Back in MetaTailor, click Import. This time, select the Avatar Import option. Import the Avatar FBX. The avatar will appear in the viewport with any embedded materials already applied. Click Next and review the landmarks. Landmarks are how MetaTailor maps out the proportions and measurements of an avatar. The landmarks will automatically map to the avatar, but you can refine and adjust the landmarks by clicking on them. When you're done, click Next. That's it. You've just imported an avatar. Now you can open the content browser and start crafting. To get started with MetaTailor, head on over to metatailor.app and sign up for the early access. We can't wait to see what you create.